everyone, it's Nancy Homeschool Scrapper here, and today I wanted to share with you the goodies that we got in the Prima Art Venture 2014 classes. Um, I showed you what came in the goodie bags, and I've shown all the projects that we made, but these are what was left over, and I thought I'd share with you. Some of these are the new things that are coming out just this season from Prima, so very exciting. Um, we have, this one was for Jamie Doherty's Bloom Girl class. We have one of her new Bloom Girl stamps. Um, there was, a, of course, the chipboard sheet was full, but I used the chipboard on my project. We have uh, the brads came in there. We have some really pretty flowers, lots of flowers, and more flowers, and yet more flowers, and more flowers. Guess you can't have a bloom girl without flowers. We have lots of flowers. It is possible that some of these things got mixed in from other kits too, so I guess we'll see. Um, cute little paper clips. I don't know if you can see them, but they're super, super sweet. We have some flare with a little stamp and a bit of trims. I guess I should put those on my project. So that is one box. This next one is the princess set uh, flowers. <laughs> These are the the papers were all from the princess collection from um, from Prima. Also coming out this season, we have flowers. Um, another set of flower with a cute little stamp. An entire package of ATCs. Flowers. Oh, these are cute. This C this CHA. We have some little tassels that I really liked. We have paper clips. Um, we got the shabby resin treasures, the little bird baths. Super cute. We have bling. We have paper clips. And then um, I guess they were sh something happened and we weren't able to get something didn't come in. So because of that, they decided to share with us the entire collection of paper on top of what we got for our project. So these are the new Princess Collection paper. So we have one that's a leftover. Some of these, of course, I used. This is Lily. Uh, Ella. Olivia, Mia, Ava, the collage sheet, Charlotte, Sophia, and then this last piece is Ella. So those things were in that class. Um, this is the Something Blue set. We have I mean, just everything Prima. You know, there was tons and tons of flowers. We have flowers and flowers, um, some brads and candy dots. Flowers and more flowers. Um, some little 3 by 4 ATCs. Some of the larger ATCs. Um, lots and lots of beautiful papers. Of course, all my leftover packaging is in here. Paper clips. I think we used paper clips in just about every project that we did. Um, we have some chipboard. Unfortunately, mine's kind of falling out of its packaging. And then, and then of course, we got some papers to go with that. Um, this is, oh goodness, the stationary desk collection, and in it we have, guess what, flowers, more flowers, flowers, a cute little mask, some of these, these are really fun, they're um, wood flowers, little flat, and they have a really cool texture, and they're double sided, one side is brown, and one side is more of the grays and blacks. We have trims, some chalk edgers, and more, and there were flowers, and then 
these we had little street signs I used it on my project of course but there's two other signs in there uh, some more trims and more flowers and then lastly we have the cartographer which was the class that Frank taught um, surprise flowers more flowers beautiful flowers a fun little frame some brads and candy dots more flowers flowers look at that bling Ooh, so pretty um we have some steampunk junkyard findings some more junkyard findings we have little bits and pieces of leftover flowers um some flare with another stamp some more we have of course lots of leaves um let's see this is the chipboard for the collection it looks like i used one piece um, and finally here's some more some brads um as you can see these classes were just full of goodies the between the class itself which when you divide the price by six classes and then you think of how much we got for the goodie bag and then how much product is just left after making six full complete beautifully embellished projects there's just so much there and um, so I highly recommend if you ever get the chance to take one of these and attend one of these classes that you do so um, I think the things that were in Anna's class um, and here's some of them the the metals and things we used they got mixed in there were flowers and all kinds of things but um a lot of these got mixed in so uh, but i recommend that you try and take them if you check out my blog there'll be a giveaway i'm going to give away some of these goodies and uh thanks a lot for stopping by bye bye